good evening everybody first of all i am thanking uh, mbss as well as uh, iims to give us uh, to give me the opportunity to present a paper on a case study uh, here uh, i am taking up about three four projects and uh, how that it has been executed and then uh, uh, really as commercials that how it is being successful so we just move on to the subject current activity in structural steel is driven by commercial structures and how in the topic that i am addressing now first of all commercial structures if, if you define what is commercial structures uh, in terms of buildings if you take other than residential building like offices hotels malls convention centers hospitals and uh, say institute institutional educational institutions all these things comes under say commercial structures and if you take uh, uh, overall uh, survey in the uh, as high rise buildings if you take uh, uh, which has been taken up few years back the number of buildings which are being in concentration in asia is the heaviest which is almost about 33% per se in the whole uh, say construction industry as in, in the whole world is concerned of which if you take as cities within 25 cities in india we are there on 23rd and it's about 470 plus numbers of towers are being uh, say they estimated that it is going to be constructed and of which if you take as commercial structures almost everything is commercial structures except few which are residential and that is all in our present uh, testing the developers are right now started moving into residential buildings in structural steel whereas major portion almost about 90 percentage of the structures are commercial uh, related right now. and if you take as material if you see the graph or the chart which we are presenting here initially most of the structures have started with steel in way back in 1930s and later completely it has been uh, taken up into concrete and the later part that merging of two structures together uh, two material together that it has been taken up as composite and presently according to the high rise levels whether it is 20 story or 30 story or 40 story the material which is really beneficial being analyzed in most of the cases as high rise buildings that we have started using with composite structures and as if you see the even subject which is related to sustaining of the growth development that meets the needs of the present without compromising the ability of the future generations to meet their own needs which is actually like a green building concept where right now structural steel can be a major thing as our earlier speakers have discussed mostly into a reusage of the material where steel is the best option comparing with any other material now in terms of commercial buildings we just go through two three all the projects which are which are being displayed is being constructed by us and that offices if you take one of the high rise building in say singapore republic plaza has been done by us uh, then the tiara towers and the burj al arab the right now uh, the tallest building in the world 828 meters is also done by us and if you take the offices